This is Wankulukuku Road. It stretches from the Kabosu traffic lights and brings you up to the places of Seguku Katari. And currently, we are after Bonamwaya town and we are headed for Ngobe. That is the town that is next after Bunamwaya. And from Ngobe, it will be Seguku Katari. And well, I want to show you the places of Seguku Katari. Hope you enjoy the video. Please help me subscribe to this channel if you haven't subscribed. And also, you can turn on the notifications after subscribing. And remember, please remember to give this video a thumbs up. You will have done something great. I have finally made it to 1,000 subscribers and I want to thank you guys for all coming and to the returning subscribers, I want to greatly thank you guys. I won't disappoint you. I'm going to do more, more of these and the quality will keep improving every other time. I thank you very much. Remember to put a comment down in the comment section of what you think of the video. Or any other place you want me to go and visit that is in the surrounding areas of Kampala Wachiso I will be going there for you and bring to you those beautiful moments this road is a good road it is a new road and it has lights on it well the lights don't function but the, the road is in a good condition Hopefully you enjoy the video. Let me leave you to watch the video till the end. Thank you guys. So currently I am in Seguku, Seguku Katale. This is where I am and this is the hill. As you can clearly see that is a, a tea plantation in Kajansi. I don't really know its name but wow and you can see this side only that the sun is too much. These neighborhoods are beautiful. Uh, upside it's someone's home and that's how it looks. It's forested area it's in the forested area and the other side parts of Lueza and the other one is the flyover in Kajansi plus the other side that is Mutungo Mutungo Chitiko yeah Mutungo Bina is the one the other side of Boyogere that side is Mutungo Bina and this side is Mutungo Chitiko Hello guys, welcome to this vlog. It's Ivan Atayre here again. I am the CEO, I am the boss, I am the editor, I am the planner, I am everything of this channel. So welcome back again. Today I am somewhere in Seguku Katali. Yeah, this road, the one you're seeing right behind me is the road that stretches from the Kabusu lights. Yeah. It stretches and it's called Wankulukuku Road and it is still Wankulukuku Road even upside, even this side. And well, this place is not far away from Kajansi and it gives you beautiful views right here. Right where I am, it is only beautiful views if you can clearly see. Uh, I want to cross like this and show you down, down. There are beautiful structures and I think someone may get land this side I'm just thinking because there is a lot of 
of land with nothing only agriculture no buildings no what meaning it would be easy to be sold so anyone looking for land seguku could be seguku katale could be that place and wow it, the buildings i'm seeing here look nice and uh, in an area which cannot easily flood and an area which is not a low-lying one it can't easily flood the ones that can easily flood i think not here not here if you can clearly see yeah that is the road that connects to Lueza and I'm going to be taking you through up to Lueza and from Lueza I will connect back home that is in much India that's why I'll connect and I will end the video I think at Chibuye that's where I'll end the video and please enjoy this video with me and let's go together and like I told you in one of my videos one of my previous videos I told you guys that this is the shortcut to Entebbe it connects you to Entebbe road it helps you beat the traffic jam on the old Entebbe road yeah it helps you and it's all nice only that the bad thing it has its humps are still new and the road is also new the humps will hit you hard more so that bigger hump even the small ones they are also still big so you need to use this road with a car that has nice shocks a border border or a motorcycle with with new shock absorbers and this is how the area looks these are some of the And it is at this point where the road joins the old Entebbe Road. Also, allow me to remind you that late last year, this road was repaired. It was given a, a renovation because it had it was in a bad state and well at the moment it looks good though it is still narrow not that much wide and yeah it's good no potholes and it helps you cruise fast to the airport without any difficulty
Ciao. Thank you. 